Good morning, it's a wet weekend and perfect riding conditions for on the sand. Bit of news, in about seven weeks we're going to Mongolia, riding the, the Gobi Desert. Anyway, we're going nomadic off-roads. Uh, there's 12 versus 12 mates heading over there for a nine day ride, um, riding FE Husky 450s. Uh, anyway, so we decided to go and get a bit of training in. We've only got seven weeks to go. It's been a bit wet lately, so we haven't had a ride for a couple of weeks. So we've been doing a bit of CrossFit with mountain biking, but we've loaded up the Huskies, got the 701 out, um, and we are meeting at a mate's place, David Green's, and we're heading across the ferry. And we're going to do a bit of a beach run. So we're going to start doing a lot of sand riding from now on. So we're just going to hit uh, some back tracks and some sand and uh, get used to that beast of a uh, surface that we're, no one's really accustomed to unless you live down in Victoria and love riding the Hattar. All right, so we'll get going and I'm gonna meet the boys in a half an hour. We're gonna check some tire pressures. I normally run uh, around 20. So I might uh, run, uh, but we've got a bit of rock to do, so I might do maybe 18 in the rear and 16 in the front. I stalled it. Yeah, so I'll do that. Um, tire pressures, bit of fuel. Okay, decided 18 all round. I'm using a Pirelli Scorpion TT Rally tire on the front. It's a sand tire. It's also a really good dirt tire, and it's really reasonable on the on the tar. There she's there. She's a bit old, but look at it, still in good nick, and. The reliable old 606 on the rear, which is still one of my favourite tyres. Okay, let's get going and meet the boys. Into a right. So today I'll be running our normal Garmin and my Gaia. Gaia is really easy to use. I do use um, I do have Hema 4x4 and Explorer, but um, the boys have all been using Gaia lately, and it's been pretty damn good. So, going to continue on with that. Um, before you hit the sand, if you've got a 701, there's got a few modes. So you've got one, which is road, two, which is off-road, which gives you ABS on the front and on the rear. And you've also got traction control, which is a little orange button there. So what I'll be doing before I go on the beach, I'll be pressing the traction control, which stays on like that. So now it's full power. And then hold the button down here. You go on mode two like that, sorry, hit traction control again, you just back the throttle off, and now I've got full traction, ABS is on the front, not from the rear, and I've got full power, so when you're spinning on the beach, um, it won't bog up. Alright, that's just a hint in case you uh, don't know about the traction control and when you're riding sand, and also it works in mud as well. Alright, heading up to the ferry. Away we go.
that's it there. Just there, to the left. Yeah. Right, eh? so we'll do, now there'll be puddles. Hello, right, Granny, you're out. I came up here a few weeks ago, and it was um, it was pretty wet, but it's fun, fun in the in the when it's dry, well, well wet like this. Yeah, we're coming. This gets real muddy down here. It's no, I know, I know. Well, that's that's standard. I don't want to wet your pips, so I'm going to come around on the right hand side. Is he shooting? Yep.
Right, oh, that's that's Plumber Track. Around this corner, and we're out. Yep. <laughs> you got to watch. You got to watch him. That's the way in the coin he's there. Nice boys, nice. Cool. This, this this road will be a camp. These will be campgrounds here. There's going to be another road up high up there on the right hand side. Crescent for a uh, a coffee boys. Yeah. Go fast, dude. There's a walk up here as well. Just goes back there, comes up over the top, and there's um the there's a cave. You go down with a rope and you walk inside the inside underneath the cliff. Yeah. They're all good things to go and do when you're up here, you got you got time. This is a really good surf spot at low tide. So in the, see that little, um, see that little, that bush there, Stephen, up there behind you on the right, see it's got a little slope on it, up behind there there's a, like a big clearing, and we used to camp in there before this became National Park, and surf this in winter time and low tide, look at that little wave, uh, well we probably, we probably did, <laughs> probably did. Go people. Should have told this for Nick, this would have been a good enduro loop. Yep. Yep. This this reminds us of uh, Tasmania when we went up that.
This has got to be one of the best bakeries anywhere, I reckon. What have I got here, people? Anything? Oh, yep. Stephen, come, come up to your left, Stephen. There's a shallow section just there, I can see. Oh, it could be deep. Look, this motorbike's come up here. Right, oh, that does look a bit deep. Yeah. All right, I'll go and have a look. Oh, come on, people. No, I'm only joking. I'll go and have a look at the river mouth here. Yeah, no, I reckon that's the go. I reckon, I reckon come along here. Let me have a look here. I'll wait for this wave to go back. Yeah, I reckon this is the, this is the spot here. Right, I'm going across. Yep. Yep, just there. Yeah, anywhere just there is pretty good. Yeah, it's not. Yeah. Where's people? He's having a, he's having a slap. He's having a slap. Yes? Did, did they go over that? Yeah. That would be scary, wouldn't it? Oh, shit. So you hit the button on the top of the left-hand side and the TC will come up. So it'll glow, it'll glow orange. Just hold it. You can do it on the run, you just got to keep the throttle off. Just hold it. And, yep. You got it in two. You got it in two. Yep. Don't go too quick. Just there to the left. Go left now. Yep. It. Beautiful. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> well, you just spent you just spent three months with him. You should know what he's you should, you should know what he's like. This is good. Um, this is good practice for the uh, Mongolia trip. <laughs> oh, he's lining you up. He's lining you up. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh he's an arsehole. <laughs> oh. Is it? Oh, no. We're going to make a move. I better, I better turn my hand warmers off. Yeah, just keep, just cool down a bit. Have you got a red thermometer on yours, have you? Yeah, that, that's, I reckon that could be just overheating a bit. When the surf's good on nor'easters in summertime, this headland's really good, so it's real protected. It gets real clean here when there's no water coming out of the creek, and you all park in that little bay just in there, around that corner there, people, you are. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but it's a different time of year. Sometimes the sandbags way out there, Pip, um, Stephen. Yeah, good spot, eh? Right, I'm coming down. So spice getting a bit hot. Let's check her out. Can you hear the fan? My fan's not even running, look. 
That's quite cool. Oh, it's a flash one. I like I like exploring, Stephen. I found my own little track here. Here we go. Are you the last one, Stephen? Right up. Oh, you'll see it when you come to it. I don't really know. That's it here, where people is now. That's it. Have you? Okay, yeah, well this is it. This will take you all the way to, I don't know, Dormore River or something. Yep. There can be some rocks on the track somewhere, I can remember. But it's sand. <laughs> Look at these bikes for back it in. Hey? Like, yeah, you know, just get the back brake on, slide it in. Oh, I'm, I'm sitting down, I'm being lazy. Hold your shit together up there, boys. It's not, it's not hard, is it? video we're coming down the beach and both GoPros their batteries went full I must have had one on by accident and the one on on the back got a bit wet so didn't get an ending as we uh, pulled up at Port Macquarie again but that was a wicked beach run that we had um, was, we are training to go to Mongolia uh, and that was a pretty easy beach session it was uh, quite wet it had been raining for a while but um, anyway it's good practice and I hope you liked uh, what you saw, like, subscribe you have, and uh, we'll catch up with you. The next uh, video we're gonna have is our South Coast trip, mountain biking out in Aruma, and then heading to the snow.
all right catch you later bye